Hey, what's up, YouTube? It's Friday, October 25th, 2013. I am your Saturday vlogger. Welcome to Proof Weight Loss of Your Works. Um, I apologize, I missed last week. And I'm going to touch over those, uh, those questions first. Um, last week's topic was, has weight loss surgery given you what you wanted? What did you want for your life and hope for, believe, could be our desire from your choice of weight loss surgery? Did you get what you wanted? Okay. Um, has weight loss surgery given you what you wanted? Yes. Uh, what I really wanted was to uh, lose the weight and, and maintain it. Um, I've lost weight before, um, but never been able to keep it off. So, absolutely, I've got what I wanted. I've been keeping the weight off, and uh, no complaints here. Um, what did you want for in your life? Hope and believe could be and desire for your from your choice of weight loss surgery. Again, it's the same thing. You know, my my hope was to get rid of the weight and stabilize it and and keep it off for you know for healthy for healthy reasons, uh, having kids and stuff. Really, I there's not much I can say. I mean, it's done what it was supposed to do and I'm keeping the weight off without too much uh, too much work um, what else uh, yeah that's been, that's pretty much it for last week's topic I mean basically did you get what you wanted yes I got what I wanted um, I've been able to lose weight before and Never been able to keep it off. So absolutely, did I get what I wanted? Yes, I got I got the weight off, and I'm able to keep it off uh, four years now. So no regrets. Um. All right, on to this week's topic. Uh, what are you eating today? That's the topic. And the questions are: What is for breakfast? What is for breakfast, lunch, and dinner? Do you pre-plan meals? Do you eat what you get a taste for? Do you find yourself stuck in the dieter's food cycle? Is your current food strategy working for you? Alright, what are you eating today? I've gone over this a few times in a couple other previous videos. Um, I'm very simple. I don't require much as far as variety. Um... Every day from morning, I have a coffee to start with, and I have a slice of toast, uh, buttered, one slice buttered, and I take out my vitamins. And then after that, I have a protein shake. Uh, use, you know, most days of the work, I'm work, most, most days of the week, I'm working. So I bring pretty much the same thing every day. I bring uh, a Chobani yogurt, which is a little high in sugar for some people, but I don't have stomach syndrome, so it doesn't affect me, and it's got the protein I want. Um, I take two protein bars. One is a uh, Nature Valley protein bar, and the other is a uh, Pure Protein protein bar. Um, and I take a couple of uh, Granola Chewy bars. So... The highest calorie one is 200 calories. I don't always eat all the bars I bring. Um, and that's pretty much what I have uh, Monday to Friday, uh, sometimes Monday to Saturday, depending on if I'm working Saturday. And Sunday, if I'm home, I, you know, I'll probably cook an omelet or something. Uh, do you pre-plan your meals I do as much as I can I don't always do I mean if I'm able to pre-plan then yes I mean you know when I go to Costco if you want to consider pre-planning yes I you know buy what I want I buy either I buy some fish I buy some meat I buy some chicken 
in, uh, in a way that's pre-planning. So absolutely, I pre-plan my meals as much as I can. Um, pre-planning is the way to go. If you don't pre-plan, don't have the foods available that you can eat, obviously you are going to make wrong choices. So pre-plan, have the foods available for you to eat that you can and uh, you'll be most successful successful sorry um, do you eat what you get a taste for absolutely I mean I can't really name any specific that I get a taste for but I eat pretty much what I want um, obviously portions are different but I mean, my, my, my tastes have changed from surgery. Uh, you know, I no, long, I no longer desire pasta. Do I like it still? Absolutely. Um, I don't eat, you know, really spaghetti or anything, but, like, I'll see something on a menu like uh, lobster ravioli. I'll have lobster ravioli. Um, so I definitely, you know, may not be a big desire, but I still desire pasta, and, and I, I eat it on occasion, not, not very often. Um, I can't count my hands per year that I've had pasta. So, I definitely eat what I desire when I want to. Um, occasionally I'll, you know, I like ice cream, so occasionally I'll have some ice cream. Is it a big amount? No. So, portions are, you know, in control, and I eat what I want, what I have a taste for. Do you find yourself stuck in a dieter's food cycle? No. Um, I don't consider my life now as I'm on a diet, but I do eat differently now than I did pre-surgery, and I don't considered a diet or cycle because it's not a diet um and that's pretty much it for that is your current food strategy working for you yes what i'm doing right now and what i've been doing for the past four years has been working for me do i eat the same thing all the time no um mainly when i go out to restaurants it's all about making choices uh majority of time I make the right choice I look for stuff that's high protein um, no pasta and uh, I don't really eat I don't eat bread too much um, besides in the morning when I have toast so yeah I mean when I go to a restaurant I tr you know I look at all the menu items and I check them out and, and decide which one has the most protein uh, and vegetables, you know, you can substitute stuff for vegetables. Um, but occasionally, I'll, I'll, you know, I'll order something like the wrap, lobster ravioli. Uh, but not usually. I'm a big steak guy, so normally when I go to a restaurant, I order steak. Um, ribeye steak is my favorite, so it has more flavor. It's a little more, a little more fatty than most steaks, and that's why it has more flavor. Um, but I'll do chicken, I'll do fish, uh, pork, I'm staying away from my, I've said it before, I'm not a big pork guy anymore because I, I get pork stuck all the time, so do not do that. Anyway, that's about it for this week, and, uh, I hope you got something out of this. Um, thumbs up, don't thumbs down, subscribe, rate, uh, post response video if you like, or ask any questions, and uh, I will see you next week, next Saturday. Stay tuned tomorrow for the next edition of Proof Weight Loss Already Works. Have a great week. Talk to you guys later. Bye.